Anaplan Champions, how are you? Well, listen, I just watched Tiffany's video, which was excellent, by the way, and it inspired me to add something of my own as it relates to organizing your data or organizing your lists or modules. And what I wanted to share with you is how I apply my organization with system modules, which I think are probably the most important modules there are as they really affect the efficiency of your models overall and the applications and the reusability of a lot of the data. So as you can see here, I have a system module, or here's, a, here's my model, and here are all the system modules. You can see them. I organize them by administration, time and versions. Um, then I get into the different properties, and then here's all the like flat lists that I've got as well. And the one I wanted to show you in particular is this one. And in every module, every system module, no matter what list I create, every time I create a list, I always create a system module, always, no matter what the list is. And in this particular case, I, in every list, I always add, I'm sorry, in every system module, I always add a list section, a section for properties, a section for other, other things I want to do, and a section for filters. And I just fill these in just as a constant routine. Very important. And I will tell you, if you do this every time you create a list, the supportability will be so much easier and the people that come in after you that have to help support your applications will thank you very, for, a lot for doing things like this. So I hope this is a helpful tip. Um, but always try to remember to create those system modules every time you create a list. Take care.